We begin Wake Up Sleep at 425 this Friday with some breaking news. A deadly shooting just before midnight in North Columbus. Our photographer arrived on scene soon after at the McGuffey Market. Police say they found a man shot to death on East Hudson. We are now learning from police that there was an argument at the market and someone shot the man as he drove away. We will update you as soon as we learn more. Right now, as you wake up on this Friday, people are gearing up for red, white and boom. It is back and taking a live look from our Skyview camera. This is downtown Columbus, a little hazy on this kind of humid Friday, but you can see the Levesque Tower there lit up in red, white and blue colors. And of course, by the end of the day tonight, this whole area will be lit up with fireworks. Exciting Friday here as we begin the first day of July. Thanks for joining us. I'm Angela and Tracy Townsend is off. Let's get to Clay Gordon right now. Clay is joining us this morning in the field and Clay, you're there at Red, White and Boom. Yeah, it's not as hazy here on the pavement on the Rich Street Bridge. You can see the Levesque over me just lit up at 4 a.m. We're getting it all excited to start this off for Red, White and Boom tonight, but it's all weather pending. So let's go over to Doppler 10 meteorologist Jeff Booth. Jeff, get us started today. What are we looking at? Way, way to put the uh, put the, the, the pressure on me. All right, so we've got some showers. We've got some storms in the forecast. Now, it's not going to rain all day. Right now, it does look like we'll have the chance for some rain into the mid to late evening. It does look like there could be a little window for that red, white, and boom, uh, at least at 10 o'clock. But this is what we're watching, a feature off to the northwest of us. This will bring us a chance for rain, especially tonight into the overnight. We're going to time this out for you hour by hour coming up. And we'll also let you know well, how many more days get into the 90s on that 10-day. All right, Jeff, thank you. Also, we have Tina Ramos down at Red, White, and Boom. And Tina, you're there before half a million people join you today. Yeah, and we can definitely feel the build down here too. More and more vendors streets here. And yes, there'll be a half a million people downtown. So what can they expect when the lights go off tonight in terms of red, white, and boom? We got a closer look at that. That's coming up. Let's go ahead and check in with Gabriela Garcia though. See what we can look like on the roads. Yeah, it's a busy morning all around. We've got construction wrapping up in Dublin, some downtown ramp up construction also ramping up. I will let you know about that on my maps as well as give you some red, white and boom closures. That's all coming up. So we are, of course, counting down now to the big boom tonight. You can see from our count countdown clock, rather 17 hours away and change. Of course, Central Ohio's news leader is back in 90 seconds with full coverage and all of your top headlines.